Hey, in this video, I wanted to talk about a common problem that many users of Word face. And the problem is that of ensuring that all of your images have the same size in Word. For instance, you might have a bunch of images. You might want to resize them or specify the size such as the height and width of the image. You might want to do the same thing for all of the other images. This can be extremely useful. For instance, if you are writing a thesis report and you have two sub figures and you want to align them in two columns. Or say you have a bunch of images and you want to create a collage. For all of these use cases, it's extremely useful that you not spend too much time positioning images the way you want. The manual technique to specify the size of images is to click the image and you'll see this new picture format menu that opens up. Click on it and here you can go ahead and specify the size of the image such as the height and width. Alternatively, you can right click the image, go to size and position, specify the values that you want for the height and width. You can also choose whether to lock the aspect ratio have the height and width as a percentage relative to the original picture size. After you're done, you click OK. Now, if you want to repeat the same process for the other images in your document, this is going to be extremely tedious. So what I recommend instead is that after you have adjusted the size of one image, then you click the next image. On the menu above your menu bar, you will see this quick access toolbar and here you should see the third option as control Y to repeat the action that you carried out. In this case, it was the format drawing object action. Click the option that says repeat format drawing object to repeat the same operation on the second image. You can do the same thing for the third image as well. But if you do not see this option, you can go to this tell me window, type redo, click on redo and you'll see that the third image has also been resized to match the dimensions of your first image. So this is a very useful technique to ensure that all of the pictures in your Word document have the same height, width and aspect ratio. I hope you found this video useful. If so, let me know in the comments below. As always, thank you for watching.